the download will be over here. And I will get back to you guys once that is done downloading. Okay, so here I am. My uh, download has finished. And for me, I have Google Chrome, like I probably mentioned before. So for me, it's easy. I can right click and do show in folder. But I will do it for, uh, I will do it the difficult way for people that don't have Google Chrome. What you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go into my computer or this PC or whatever you want to call it and you're going to want to go into downloads then you're going to want to find RimWorld here it is Alpha 7 we are going to drag this out here the one thing that you will need when you download RimWorld is you will need WinRAR or 7-Zip and I will link you to both of those in the description of this video after you get WinRAR uh, which should be a pretty simple installation. It comes with its own installer. You're going to want to open and extract the file to the same folder. <clears throat> Feel free to pause the video at any time. <clears throat> Excuse me, to if anything is too quick for you. But anyway, after that, you will not need the zip file, so I am deleting it, and just simply do that by clicking the delete key on your keyboard if you do not know. Now, you're, what you're going to want to do is open up this file, open up this file and here is where all your games are and you'll see right here there's an application it's called rimworld 584win.exe don't worry if you don't have the exe I just have the file extensions on there if you just have rimworld 584win you're in the right place that's the application that you start to launch the game so uh, if you want you can leave your folder like this on your desktop and just start the game no problem but uh, so if you have your folder on your desktop or wherever you have it this is for the update so I have my folder already in my Steam so what I'm gonna want to do is I'm gonna open up my file explorer again and uh, I actually have it in my Steam folder because this is where I like to have all of my games so I'm gonna go down to Steam and Steam Apps and Common. Okay, and and where is it? Okay, Real World, right here. So as you can see, <coughs> we have oh, sorry, we have basically the same exact folders, and they are exactly the same except in the mods folder. But anyway, we're not going to get into that. They are the same exact because I already have 1.7. What do you know? But I'm going to show you this anyway. Now, if you already have the game and you actually have some mods for it, and uh, oops, not in here, in here, mods. I have four mods or three mods, excuse me. The core is your primary game. What you're probably going to want to do is uh, move them into uh, your mods folder in your new updated one. So just drag them over here, put them in there. And then what you're going to want to do is delete everything out of this folder. Click the select it all. Click the delete key. You won't be needing it. Then uh, move all this stuff in here. Uh, you might want to check to make sure all your mods are in there. That's good. If you have any saves or anything, don't worry about it. All of it should be transit uh, should be transitioned. No, no problem. So now that I have this, I do not need this folder anymore. And uh, this shortcut will no longer work because uh, the rim world is not there anymore. So what you're going to want to do is delete that as well. You will not need that because you actually have a different one right here. So what you're going to actually want to do is you're going to want to right click it, click send to and go to desktop and this will create a shortcut. You probably don't want all the other stuff on there. So you might want to rename it to just plain old rim world is what I do and there okay so now as you can see I can exit out of here click on rim world and uh, let's see yep here we go you might get a little page like this that's in 1.7 but you'll it'll pop up like this and you'll be good so uh, that is how you update rim world if you have bought the game uh, if you did not buy the game, that is not my problem. I do not support uh, pirating this game. This is a great game. Support the developer. And I feel like he deserves the money for it. 
uh, they're updating it great so if you don't have it consider buying it but anyway I hope you guys en enjoyed this video and I hope that it was helpful and uh, leave me a like if you want to have more RimWorld tutorials and comment on it if you want to give me any hints or uh, if you really like it subscribe and I'll see you guys later